We will give material to it and set a camera. Then we will set the lighting and lastly we will do the rendering. Start learning 3D modeling, texturing and lighting. Shift A, Mesh and Plane, bring it down, scale it big, press tab for the edit mode, 2 for the edge mode and select the edge and extrude it to Z axis. Let's set the camera angle, click on the camera icon, now press N, click on the view and camera to view, check that and now set the angle of the cake, so our cake this is the front background will scale it little big as x now click on the camera icon now select the camera and adjust the focal length this angle is fine for me so now again click on the camera to view now we will give material to the cake now let's give material to the cake press Z render select the top icing go to material properties add the material and give a name top icing go to base color click on the hex and enter the code go to metallic 0 0.1 and roughness 0 0.3 now select the top cake add the material Give a name top cake, go to base color, enter the hex code. We will not give the metallic and roughness 0 0.03. Now select the bottom icing, add the material, give a name, go to base color, enter the hex code. And here same metallic as the top icing it's 0 0.1 and the roughness is 0 0.3 now same way give the material to the all objects now I applied material to the all objects color code and material properties of all materials are given in the resource section so please check that and now for the flame we'll give a different material here add the material give a name and in the surface click on that and select the emission and for the color click on that and enter the code That is yellow color and give the strength is 5 it will show the glow now let's add the light 
shift A light and area light bring it to the top increase the power to 500 now go to Z and render view increase the size copy the light shift D bring it to side and rotate it again shift D Our lighting is set now. The top light color is white, power is 300 watt, and the size is one only. And the, at the light, left light color is white, power is 500 watt. For the right light, also color is white and power is 500. Now, let's set the render settings. Now let's do the render settings. Go to render properties. Select the EV. Click on the ambient occlusion. Now click on the bloom also. Click on the screen space reflection and the refraction also. Now go to render tab and render image. Now wait for few seconds and here is the our rendered image. To save image, go to image, save as, select the JPG and the click here, name the image, render.jpg and save. And this is our final result. You can add different lights and play with the lighting and other settings. But this is how you render your scene and set up everything.